Hey, what's up guys? Today on Bad Beast Barbecue, we're doing some spare ribs on the old school Rectech Mini. And we're gonna be doing something we haven't done before. We're gonna be using ketchup as a binder right after this. He's a bad beast on that barbecue On the grill of the smoker He knows just what to do He's a bad beast on that barbecue Right, guys so we finished with our cook man these look fantastic i've already cut a rib off the end so i had a pre-taste man they taste fantastic i'm gonna go ahead and cut another one as you saw from the close-ups of the ribs that uh, six pepper seasoning blend from tones um was really pronounced on the surface of it and the red color of the tones plus the red color of the ketchup gave a nice color to the ribs there's a beautiful smoke ring on here and the ribs are really really tender and juicy we'll go ahead and have another taste man these are some fantastic ribs you guys have got to try that tones seasoning blend um and like i said i don't know whether the tone seasoning blend over uh powered the ketchup but uh the ketchup might have played a role in the color of it uh, and it maybe played a role with the uh, tenderness of it uh, with the acid and tomatoes. So, but this is fantastic. Ketchup as a binder worked out really, really well. Hey, well, that's it. Hey, thanks for joining us today. Hey, I'll put all the ingredients that I used in the description block down at the bottom. You might be able to find that tones on Amazon or in your local store. And also, if you guys are interested in a Rectech smoker, check out rectechgrills.com. 
They got some great stuff out there, okay? And well, hey, that's it. Thanks for joining us today. Hey, please consider subscribing and hitting the like button if you like this video, okay? And like we always say, where there's smoke, there's fire. And if it's fire, then damn it, there just might be a barbecue there. Hey, as always, hey, we'll see you guys around the smoking.